Andy Mogul. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the last episode of Your FX for 2009. As always, we're bringing you two awesome viewer submitted tutorials and the Random Effect Montage! Let's kick it off with a gruesome finger chop tutorial sent in by Chris. Hey Andy Mogul viewers, Chris here, and I'm going to show you how to make a chopped up finger effect for cheap. The first step of this build is to take your modeling wax and use your real butter knife to dig in there and take out a big glob of modeling wax. Roll your modeling wax into an upper finger shape like this. Cut where desired. Paint inside the finger red. Put the finger back together like so. Take skin tone pick up and paint on the outside of the finger. Take your toothpick and poke a hole in the finger. Knead it over so it looks less noticeable. Place it over your desired bent finger. It should look like this. Wet your plastic butter knife. Gently smooth the finger. When you cut the finger, you can see the insides on both ends. Stay tuned after the break for another Random Effects Montage and another tutorial! Yeah man, well the, I guess, you told me the right directions but I don't know. Time for the Random Effects Montage! Huh! Our last video comes in from Blake and is a tutorial on how to make a gore chest. Okay, this is the latex gore chest tutorial. And supplies you need liquid latex, clay, I used oil based, acrylic paints, paint brushes, baby powder, and blood. This is how the sculpture started out. Then I put some skin around it. I used like 12 layers of liquid latex. Just pretty much brush it on, that's all you gotta do. And baby powder helps a lot. It keeps it from sticking to itself. Then you need some paints and when you mix the, you need to mix the paint with some liquid latex too. That would keep the paint from chipping. So this is blood. You should put the blood on after you take the demold it. So I put it in the freezer for like maybe 10 minutes just to harden the clay so it doesn't really stick that much to it. So there you have your latex prosthetic. You can either use spirit gum to put it on you or uh, glue it to a shirt, which was what I did. Thanks for watching this tutorial, and make some gore. Thus ends another episode of Your FX, but before we go, I've got some important year-end announcements. First off, make sure and check out Bobby Miller's special Sundance episodes coming out every Thursday. That's right, Indie Mogul's own Bobby Miller got his film into Sundance and needs your help. Check it out Thursdays for more details. And lastly, you need to check out next Monday's episode of BFX. It's the first episode of 2010 and I'm going to be making an announcement that will change the Indie Mogul universe forever. Oh yeah, it's gonna be big, so you better be ready for it. Let us know what your New Year's resolution is by leaving a comment down below and we will see you next year.